Thank you very much. Council, greetings. Mayor, your worship, good to see you all once again. We are talking of process and procedures. I'm holding Carnegie newsletter from 2007 up to date. We have gone through this systematic procedures with you and it has been ignored. So today we come again about how we evaluate the downtown east side once more. So I'm going to table Carnegie Community Action Project out of Carnegie newsletter of November 1st, 2016, and I would love to have copies delivered to you. The city's community economic development strategy is going to council 29, which is I came yesterday and it was today. Now let me go on. What the people of the downtown east side addresses, and I'm going straight because I'm a realist and I love things to be real. And I'm getting a lot of the fantasy going on about why and this and that. We all know we all live in this city. And I love this city too much. And I'm heartbroken to see what is going on in our community, the central of our city. So this is what they came with it. Address the root causes of poverty and homelessness. An inclusive community economic development plan needs to put housing and social assistance rates from front and center and propose aggressive measures to stop gentrification, implement rent control to advocate for more social housing and to raise the rates. Implement measures to stop new zones of exclusion. The city seeks to reduce vacant storefront by 50%. By vacant storefronts are better than zones of exclusion. Zones of exclusion pushes up rent. Land values can contribute to the overall gentrification of our neighborhood. The city needs to take immediate measures to stop more zones of exclusion coming into our community and neighborhood. Use zoning, not tax exemptions to reverse the loss of shops. I know I don't have too much time, so I'm going through. Stop the criminalization of all survival work. Expand and support non-market food services in the downtown east side. Ensure jobs for low-income <coughs> residents. Take measures to destigmatize unemployment. And that is a lot of people in the downtown east side can't work. The city needs to make immediate measures to destigmatize unemployment in the downtown east side and recognize the dignity of who don't have a formal job. And Mr. Nova, you wanted to know what is your fee. I would love to speak on that. As we of the low income community, I'm a mother of three sons and a daughter. I also work with the high risk youth with mental illness. I've seen enough. And to tell you that, don't feel too comfortable here because our generation after us is very at risk. And at your peak, Mr. Nova, I see as someone in the elitist club, the fraternity club, whether male or female, or oh, the high income club, middle class, perhaps if we have still, these are the people moving into the neighborhood and driving up prices and gentrification in the neighborhood, whereby food that people can afford based on the welfare rate, they can't because they have all moved out. If you come, I'll walk with you and I'll show you where the food used to be and where there are no more, and the yuppie shops have gone. And we say, yuppie, why? Because we have Versace in our neighborhood. How many people can afford Versace? That is what we call yuppies. And to, to end this, I would love to end with poems, because I'm a poet as well and some words of wisdom that will help us all because we are humans, we have souls. And this is a proverb from the continent I'm from below the equator where my umbilical cord is buried. Today's globalization is based on competition and profit. It will achieve a truly human face only when everyone say I while thinking we. 
This is from Aminata Traore, one of our matriarch society women. And if you allow me, I have one minute. I see that. Um, you actually have zero minutes. All right. Thank you very much. I'll give you copies of the Economic <coughs> Development Strategy from CICA. I'll make it available to you in your staff. Thank you very much for my time and for listening to me. Thank you, Ms. Afia. Thanks for coming. Um,